G'day guys, Steve here. And if you enjoy using your Celestron mount with your Celestron CPWI planetarium software and wish to use Nina as your imaging platform, then let me show you exactly how I connect all three up. So the first thing we're going to do is make sure our CPWI software is connected through our ASCOM device hub. So I'm just gonna uh, open up my ASCOM device hub and I am then going to go into tools and set up. Under telescope device here, I'm going to select choose. And here, this is where we want to point um, our ASCOM device hub to our CPWI software. All right, so once we've done that, we'll hit OK, OK, and we can minimize that. All right, so now we want to connect our, our mount up with CPWI. So I'm going to open up CPWI, go to the connection, mount USB because I have my USB um, cable connected and it's all running through my um, Prima Loose Lab uh, computer here. Uh, quick align, ready. So now it's just finding its uh, um, homing switches and we can add its uh, home position. All right, so we're all done there. So exit. And we are, we are connected, not aligned, but we are connected. No point aligning um, here anyway. Right, so once that is all done, I will minimize that screen because it's no longer sort of needed. Next, we'll open up our uh, Nina and we'll head to the telescope tab, which is under the equipment section, telescope tab. And as you can see in the drop down button up the top here, drop down menu, we have uh, a whole bunch of different um, options to pick from. Now, originally I used to just click CPWI because I thought, hey, it's there, it's, it's noticed my planetarium software. So CPWI and connect up, right? So now that we are connected, everything seems to be working how it how it should however throughout an imaging session i would get uh dropouts mount drop disconnects and that's one thing you don't want when you're uh, imaging um at night especially if you're trying to get some sleep and you've set everything up and away it goes and then all of a sudden your mount drops out disconnects that's uh that's going to ruin your night so what i've done to fix this let's disconnect the mount here is I've now gone through the device hub telescope. So device hub telescope points to the ASCOM device hub and the ASCOM device hub, which we've set up, points to the CPWI. So I'll just select that, hit connect. And we are again, all connected. Again, we can control everything. So that is how I've been able to fix any dropout issues I've had with my mount running through CPWI and Nina. Well, I hope you found this uh, video helpful. And if so, please give me a big thumbs up. Or if you've got a question, leave a comment below. And if you're new to my channel and wish to see uh, more videos like this, as well as my Astro Adventures, then please hit that subscribe button. All right, guys. Well, that's it for now. So until next time, take it easy. See yous.